So you might be trying to figure out how you can change your iPhone lock screen pass code on your iPhone. So this is pretty common. Basically, if you go ahead and unlock your iPhone, you will basically see the passcode come up like this if Face ID does not work. So you can just see the passcode will come up like this. If you want to change this, you will need to know the original passcode. So keep that in mind. You will not be able to hack into an iPhone by any means necessary. It's just not going to work. So if that's what you're trying to do, this is not the video for you. Now, what you want to do if you want to do it, you want to make your way over to your settings application, just like so. And you then want to go ahead and click on passcode and face ID or face ID and passcode. So all you're going to want to do is go and tap on this little panel and it's going to ask for your passcode. So go and type in your passcode as you normally would. And when you do that, this next panel is going to come up. Now, all you're going to want to do here, it's very, very basic. You then want to go ahead and basically find a little panel at the very bottom that says change passcode. So there's a lot of information here. You can read through it if you want to, but this little change passcode option is basically what you want to go ahead and click on. So go ahead and tap on change passcode and it's going to ask you to enter your old passcode. So now all you're going to want to do is tap in your old passcode and then it's going to ask you to enter your new passcode in. Now this is where things get a little bit more interesting because as you can see, there's like six characters here, but the passcode we had before is four. So if you want to change the number of the, the number of the like numbers you type in for your passcode, just go and click on passcode options and you want to go and click on four digit numeric code. So tap on four digit numeric code. You'll see this little pop-up come up and that is basically all you're going to have to do is now type in your new passcode that you want. And that is basically it. So if you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.